Hi everyone, it's Nalani and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I filmed this really easy pink, pretty, pretty in pink look for you guys. I actually really just wanted to test out this palette. I got this a little while ago. I hauled and showed you guys when I got it and I just never got around to using it. So I figured today would be a really good opportunity. And I skipped out on liner, lashes, the whole works. So I just really wanted to keep everything pretty easy and you know, pretty simple. So if you want to see how I got this look, please keep on watching. So I'm going to grab a little bit of this shade right here. This is Aloha and I'm taking a very small amount and I'm going to work this onto my crease area. So I'm gonna take a little bit of coconut and add the tiniest amount on top of that just to tone down the pink. It's a little pinker than I was expecting it to be. So I think I want to take this pink right here and just apply it onto my lid area. And wow, that's extremely pigmented. Okay, so I'm just pushing in this shadow and only keeping this on my lid area. I think I want to add a little bit of this shadow on top of that. Did that do anything? So I'm going to go in with this shade right here. And I'm just going to apply that into onto the center of the lid. Actually, I'm mixing these two shades together. Now going back in with coconut, I'm just taking a very small amount and I'm just applying this onto the outer portion. And then what's ever left over on my brush, I'm just going to bring over just for a little bit of definition. I also think I wanna mix in a little bit of Aloha on top of that just ever so slightly blend it out and then whatever is left over on my brush I'm just running it all the way to the inner portion so going back in with Aloha I'm just going to run a little bit of this onto my lower lash line and I'm just connecting it to the top eyeshadow now I'm just buffing that shadow down pretty far. And I think I want to take a little bit of Mahalo and add this to the lower lash line, but only the very outer portion. I'm also going to add a little bit of Honolulu on to the top of my lid and I'm just using this as an eyeliner, but I'm not winging it out. I just want to create a little bit of dimension because I'm not going in with an eyeliner. Actually, I changed my mind. I'm going to create a very small little line right here and just kind of connect. But I'm doing it really gently so it's just all blending in. And I'm just using a stamping motion. Then going back in with my brush just to blend everything out. So I took that same Honolulu shade and I just created a small little point. So I'm going to go back and mix these two shimmer shades right here and just pop this onto the brow bone with just the highest point. And I'm going to smooth it out with my finger just for a really nice blend. 
So I'm skipping out on lashes and I am just going to add a little bit of Max Teddy into my waterline. Going in with this highlighter, this is from NYX. This is the Duo Chromatic Snow Rose Highlighter. I'm going to apply a little bit on to the cheekbones. It's a beautiful pink highlighter. I'm also going to add this to the brow bone and to the nose. Add a little bit to the inner tear duct. Now going in with Milani's Romantic Rose, I'm just going to add a small amount onto the opposite of my cheek. And then I'm going to add a little bit of the Sephora Micro Smooth Powder, taking a fluffy brush and just buffing everything together. Okay, and for my lips, I'm gonna go in with this Morphe Lip Liner in Zippy, and I think I'm gonna add a little bit of Quickie Lipstick. So lip liner's on, I'm just going to blend this out. Then going in with Quickie. I feel like the lips are a little too pink. I don't hate it, but I think I'm going to add a little bit of this Peanut Brittle lip gloss from NYX just to kind of tone it down a little bit. It didn't make a huge difference, but I like it a lot more. So this is a completed look. I really liked the way everything turned out. This shadow palette is super pigmented. A little product goes a very long way. I was, some of the shadows I didn't think were gonna go on as pigmented as was. So if you get your hands on this palette, please make sure that you go in with a light hand first. It's always easier to build up your looks as opposed to just kind of trying to tone it down just makes your job a lot easier and yeah I because I went in with pink and I decided I was just going to kind of run with the whole pink idea I went in with a pink highlighter a very pink blush kept the lips pretty pink and just added a little bit of nude gloss on top because I thought it was a little too pink but yeah I also wanted to keep everything really easy really light really simple so that's why I skipped out on liner lashes Obviously, you can always add liner lashes to your looks, but I just wanted to keep it really just light, like I said. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.